What's up, guys? Hope you all are doing well today. I wanted to share with you how I do my product research and how I find products to sell on these marketplaces like Poshmark, Etsy, um, Depop, eBay, Mercari. Like any platform that you can um, use their traffic, you you definitely want to use their free traffic and um, try to sell stuff on there and like make a make an account and um, fill up your account with like hundred to 500 listings and try to sell stuff on there. So, um, what I use to find products is, um, Amazon prime. And for this, like you can find products that will ship to your house same day or in a day or two, you just kind of filter by, uh, filter by all prime. And this will show you all the products you can get to your house in like a day or two. So you can basically pretend that you have the inventory when you don't actually have any inventory. So it costs zero dollars to list all these items up. But you can like find these curtains for like thirteen dollars, resell them for like forty dollars and make like make fifteen to twenty dollars profit. And like who's saying you can't get a sale if this guy got a hundred five thousand reviews on his product? Like you can easily get one sale out of this. And don't be afraid to ship like bigger items like any any home decor products are usually pretty good, like floating shelves, for instance. Like, don't be afraid to sell like bigger items like this. It's just a big box, and then you basically just ship it out in the same box, or you go to Home Depot, get a new box if you don't want to ship it out in the Amazon box, and you ship it out to your customer. But you can get this to your house in the same day. So who's saying you can't have like unlimited inventory? Because Amazon Prime basically allows you to have unlimited inventory. And um, I like to go through di the different like categories they have here. Um, something to keep in mind is it's going to be mostly women on Poshmark, Etsy, Depop. These are like all like women based platforms. So you might want to tailor your customer niche to um, women. So you might look at like jewelry, like necklaces or something. And then um, you kind of like peep what other people are selling, piece necklace, random necklaces, and see if you can make a profit or a profit off them. So maybe like a custom necklace, one of these, or maybe like a, a jewelry box. You can kind of just like get your ideas from looking at like other products and looking at like what Amazon's like feed is giving you. So say you sell, you sell this $9 jewelry box for $30 and you can make like $15 profit. And, um, something I like to use for, uh, Etsy in particular is this thing called sale samurai. So basically your search on Etsy, once you download this extension will look like this. And you're going to look for anything with over like 3000 search volume in here. And you can find products pretty easy that will sell on Etsy. Cause like this will tell you how much, how many people are searching for a thank you gift or a thank you card. It's like 26,000 people. Like you can sell the one of them and you got to just like land your, land your products on like the first page to sell on Etsy. <laughs> but yeah, this is really um, a great method, like just using Amazon Prime and just like stealing their inventory and putting it on your marketplaces. This is a great method. It's not necessarily like legal on all these pr platforms. Like it is to a degree, but they're not promoting you to drop ship. So you kind of got to work around that. I like to not use like the white background as the first picture. So say we're selling this, like... You want to change the background up to something that's like not completely white. I mean, they don't really have many here, but you can easily do this. Um, yeah, so there's another method I'd like to share with you guys. And this is like the Timu to um, Amazon method, basically. So you're like, you're selling on Amazon now and you're finding the like cheap products on Timu. So say you get this backpack for $5. You're going to sell it on Amazon for $20 and you're selling it for more like a realistic price that uh, people will like buy more of like 
when you're selling from Amazon to the other marketplaces, you're going to be having to like upcharge people, like sell sell a, a backpack for like $50 or $40 to make some profit. But um, Timu allows you to buy the stuff like at China prices and then sell it for normal like US prices. So yeah, I just like, I like to go through all the different categories they have and um yeah use that as inspiration to like find different stuff like you can find like duffel bags like just look this up on amazon it's really not that hard to find products you just gotta put in the time and um make it happen right so you find something for like 18 dollars 20 dollars you list this up on poshmark you list it up for like 45 dollars and then Hopefully, if someone bites, someone buys it, you can make $20 profit. And um, a tool I like to use for this is a Z Drop. It'll basically allow you to just like post it directly from Amazon. It'll like highlight it in red. And then you just post it directly to, from Amazon to any marketplace that you might be selling on. But yeah, that's just some tips I had from uh, what I've been doing the past like year or so. And um, I hope you guys can find good products to sell and find a winning product that will make you a good amount of money. But um, yeah, that's it, guys. Take care.